Hello everyone, this is Benjamin here from the African Geek and you are welcome to this fantastic tutorial in Canva. Before we get started, make sure to smash and I mean smash the bell icon. Okay, no, 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 no. Smash the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get notified anytime I upload new videos. So, let's jump straight into Canva. Okay, so here we are in Canva and today we are going to be doing something very interesting here and what we are going to do is, first of all, I'm already in my document so you can see I'm not going to go 19, 20, 10, 8, no, 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 we have to be serious now. Okay, so I'll just go straight to this website called PNG Guru and you may, you may be asking, hey Benjamin, what's up? Well, no, what are you doing? I thought we were about to design a Canva, but why are we born? The thing is, I want to pick up some few goodies from here and we'll send it into Canva and do some, you know, trick or treat, you know, you know not trick or treat. I, I don't know what trick or treat means, but you know, like design something nice. Okay. So I'll just search for food and tell me, I know you like food, you know, I know you like food a lot. So this is for you. Okay. Trust me yeah so let's see what we can do we have this <laughs> beggar here and we have this <laughs> ah my goodness that's why i don't like making tutorials on food because it gets me hungry and i always get pissed off okay so which one should we choose i'll just pick this one or hmm, i'm being tempted to design the P the beggar one but i already have a design on a beggar design I already have a design on a beggar design so you can check it out and uh, yeah so let me just download this download png for free okay who doesn't like free stuff everyone loves free stuff just that when it gets to a point sometimes you need to pay for stuff yeah you can just have that on your instagram or you can use that as a quote and just you know reference me that the benjamin african a sexy geek okay so i made it tutorial um on this it was a previous tutorial i don't know if by now i've posted it or not by the time you're watching this it could be maybe that would be the next tutorial or i just posted it so yeah check it oh, okay so now i'm lost okay so what i'll do is i'll just drag my photo here and canva should do its thing okay so we have sis we have this delicious food and we are going to do some magic okay i'm going to help you to do something sexy okay so let's get started so i'll just keep my food here you we'll add some circle you can press t on your keyboard for the circle or you can just come into the elements if you don't have a keyboard okay because yeah you can use canva pro on not canva pro but you can use canva on your tablet because uh you know, i get to use my tablet sometimes and you know it's it's very interesting it, it's just like you are doing it on your pc the only thing is it doesn't come with a tablet okay it doesn't come with a keyboard pardon me so i have the circle here and i'll choose um a green color okay but i think i want it let me oh okay yeah this is this is okay this is okay then i'll just right click and send to back okay and i'll increase this to somewhere like here okay then what we can also do is we can um choose a green color okay but we wouldn't make it too green so we'll come here and uh, you know not too green but you get what i mean like okay so but not too green not too green but now um i won't we just have to be playing with the color okay i think this is a good color okay so that's one thing you should uh try doing playing with the colors picking colors from your photo okay so i think what i can also do is i'll come here and search for gradient gradient okay depending on where you're from you pronounce it differently so don't be quick to judge and say uh he doesn't even know how to speak english hey come on 
okay so this is the two color gradient okay so i can just select this one you know the circle here tap on the color tap on new color and we'll copy this okay we'll copy the color code then click on the gradient select the first color tap on new no yeah and paste i almost got confused then tap on the second color new color paste okay so we have this then maybe i can just delete this instead then we can have something dynamic okay so i can have this and i can increase the size to this and then send to back okay so this is what we have at the moment then what we can do is to add some text and this time around the text we'll be using has to be uh, it doesn't have to be straight when i mean straight like serif sans serif no 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 okay it has to be something uh interesting so what i'm going to do is i'll first of all press t on my keyboard for text okay then i'll click here and i'll come and search for brush okay so or you can script or something like that but the one i love to go for is this one looks new to me the brusher is my go-to especially when i'm designing food kind of thing so i can type healthy okay so the healthy can be here okay, healthy and you know i'd love to know what your favorite food is since we are designing and uh and i'd love to know what your favorite food is since you're designing something that has to do with food okay so you know don't don't be shy you're not a foodie or something like that you know we, we all like food so i'll just decrease this now i'll bring it here okay now i'll bring this here and i can take this back a little bit then i can have this here healthy food okay f o o d i can have it here so you just can also pick the same color if you don't mind okay because now we are trying to stick to the same color but i think this should be deeper test okay i'll use you know so i can use this or let me bring this to the bottom here and i'll rotate i'll rotate this here so this can now come to center okay then we can have healthy food but you know I, i'm not really satisfied with the colors that's one thing and i'm just being honest with you i just wish there could be something more i could do okay so maybe to keep things simple i'll just come here and just say tasty okay tasty then i'll just use a normal text um i'll come here and just choose you know my normal months right so the tasty um lunch okay let me just use lunch l-u-n-c-h i hope i spelled it correctly okay so i can have it here and i can reduce the size a little bit something like this okay send it back how come i'm not really getting the vibes okay so let's see this the food let me put it in the center let me reduce this there and i'll just see lunch for all okay I know it doesn't make sense but just uh, if we are not looking at the design no we are not looking at the words here we are just looking at creating something that uh, would be meaningful okay so I'll just keep this here then I'll duplicate okay send to back that I can and I can get this and I'll duplicate this one now I'll bring it here okay so maybe i'll just hold this increase the sizes okay look i'm finding difficult to even move my mouse 
okay so maybe i'll just come here increase the size a little bit now see daily fresh menu how do you spell menu yeah okay so i'll hit it here go back and i will change the alignment to this okay yeah then i'll reduce this i'll bring it here you know and i'll change this to windows monserrat i want maybe another version of monserrat monserrat classic i can change the color to green okay then you can have it here then maybe i'll add some um, yeah i'll just add some dummy text okay so let me just come and pick this again ctrl c ctrl v and i'll bring it here okay and i'll hit this here so it means that with the menu is what i like that's what i'm about to add okay now i want it smaller but increase so i'll just say one food is called lorem npm okay this is just a dummy text so i'll just um duplicate it so you get the main thing i'm trying to talk about okay okay so that's what we have at the moment and we are going to add some circles use this and we can put it here Okay. Maybe let me just take this and decrease the size a little bit. Okay, so the circle is here. Then I'll add a second circle. So I'll go into my uh my gradient, not my gradient, my element. I don't know why this design is just putting a whole lot of pressure on me. Ah, my goodness. And I'll reduce the size a little bit. Okay, and I'll center it here. Then I can come and say I can add another text and make this a bold version of Montserrat. Okay, so yeah. And I'll just say 25%. Okay. Increase the size. Squeeze it. Squeeze it more. And I'll take it here and I'll change the color to white okay to white and i hit it here okay this is this is cool so change no let me just give a price okay let me just see um i'll use my ghana cds okay so gh out 155 so let me just see then so that i can see as low as 10 cities okay you can get what you are seeing here so it's all part of the marketing strategy okay so i just bring this here now make this also white duplicate now say as low as you know sometimes when food is expensive it's it can be annoying <laughs> And stop having questions in your head because of what I said. Okay, so this can be here. Okay, and we can also add a logo. Okay, so I would want to bring this control C control V. Maybe bring this up. Okay. Something like this. Then we can also put duplicate and reduce the transparency of this reduce and this can go to the back okay so it can be here so i just search for a sample logo okay so i just type logo but you know if you have a logo and you're designing this i would highly recommend you use your logo okay because i don't sell food i don't do food so i'm not going to use my logo so let's say um, i'm looking for something that can be linked to food 
away um, just can but i can't change colors and it's also in canva pro so let me still see okay you know like so far i think this it may not be the best but just for the sake of this tutorial okay so i just put it here and i can say liberty foods i don't know if there's anywhere like that here in my country i haven't heard anything like that so i'm free to use it liberty foods okay And I can center this. I can move this to the top. Okay. And I'll reduce the size. Okay. I'll select. So you know we have this here. And we have this here. And you can add some details to your um how do you call it you can add maybe your call details or you know things like that so that people can be able to reach you and to do that i'll just maybe duplicate this and i'll just say for delivery for no, let me just say delivery delivery and i'll reduce this a little bit Okay, I can add. I can, I'll just add this and say plus two, three, three, zero, 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 zero. Okay. Then I can push this down, and maybe I just have to push this in a little bit. Then we have this. So I think this is looking very interesting and very sweet and sexy. You know, all inside of Canva. Isn't this beautiful? And you have to say it is beautiful. Okay, yeah. So this is no. Before I go, there's something I feel like adding leaves. I feel like adding something more. I don't know why. Let me use this one. Okay, and I'll reduce the opacity. Because since it's food, I just feel like this can be here sent to back okay let me flip horizontally send to back okay and i can do it again maybe about three send to back you know i can even rotate i can even rotate so ah so i think this is looking interesting yeah so wow i am just damn in love with this the name is you see you drained me you drained my energy and i am damn tired so i'm just glad you've been able to stay to this point and i think we've really designed something very interesting inside of canva you wouldn't get anywhere else so you know i'm just glad and just do me a favor by hitting the bell icon hitting the subscribe button hitting the like commenting checking me out on instagram okay so you can just come on instagram search for african geeks a f r i c a n g e e k s okay send me a message i look forward to receiving a message from you just say hey i watched your tutorial and i loved it if you even if you don't love it just you know say hey you know i watch your tutorial and you know he did well <laughs> you know something like that yeah so that's all i want to say and remember there is no limit to creativity the name is benjamin and i'll see you in my next video